severe weather hits California, snow, accidents, and fatalities. Over the past few days, California has been experiencing severe weather conditions, including heavy snowfall, flash flooding, and high winds. The National Weather Service has issued multiple warnings and advisories for the region. Snowfall and blizzard conditions Northern California and parts of the Sierra Nevada have been hit by a powerful bomb cyclone, bringing heavy snowfall and blizzard conditions. Snowfall rates have reached up to 2 to 3 inches per hour, with wind gusts up to 65 miles per hour, making travel nearly impossible one. Some areas have seen over 20 inches of snow, with forecasts predicting up to 10 feet of snow in higher elevations. Flash flooding and rock slides The atmospheric river associated with the storm has caused torrential downpours, leading to flash flooding and rock slides. Buddy. Oh, you got this, dude. Speed up, speed up. Thank you. The National Weather Service has warned of life threatening flash flooding and debris flows, particularly in areas with steep terrain. One several roads have been closed due to flooding and landslides, including major highways, power outages, and structural damage. High winds and heavy snow have caused significant damage, including fallen trees and power lines. homes and businesses in Washington State and Northern California have experienced power outages 1. Emergency crews are working around the clock to restore power and clear debris. Fatalities and injuries Tragically, the severe weather has resulted in fatalities and injuries. Oh, yeah, this yeah is clear that out for sure. In the Pacific Northwest, high winds have caused trees to fall, resulting in the deaths of two women in southeastern Seattle suburbs. In California, there have been reports of injuries due to accidents on icy roads and flooding. Emergency response and evacuations. Authorities have issued evacuation orders for areas at risk of flooding and landslides. Emergency shelters have been set up to accommodate displaced residents. One, residents are urged to stay indoors and avoid unnecessary travel until conditions improve. Long term impact. The storm is expected to continue through the weekend, with additional snowfall and rainfall predicted. No, I'm trying to go anywhere.
The severe weather has not only caused immediate damage but is also expected to have long-term effects on the region. The California Department of Transportation, Caltrans, has been working tirelessly to clear roads and restore access to affected areas. However, with more snow and rain forecasted, the situation remains challenging. Emergency services have been on high alert, responding to numerous incidents of stranded vehicles and accidents on icy roads. Local communities have come together to support those affected by the storm. Shelters have been set up to provide refuge for those displaced by the weather, and volunteers are distributing food and supplies to those in need. The state government has also announced financial aid for recovery efforts, aiming to help residents rebuild and recover from the devastation caused by the storm. As the weather begins to improve, the focus will shift to long-term recovery and rebuilding efforts. Oh, please get stuck. Come on. That, yeah, that's that deep shit where it's like... Oh yeah, he's stuck as fuck. He ain't going nowhere, dude. <laughs> oh shit. The long-term impact of this severe weather event is still being assessed, but it is clear that recovery efforts will be extensive. Stay safe and keep an eye on local news for updates and further instructions. Thank you for watching until the next live or the next video. I want you all to stay prayed up. We hope you liked today's topic. Please leave your comments below. If you haven't already, subscribe to the channel, share and like this video. And with that, we're out. Be sure to ring the bell to be notified of new uploads on this channel. And also comment, share, like, and subscribe.